What is going on guys? Gray here today. I'd like to talk about how the bounties will be changing in the final shape here in just a few weeks when that uh, new story DLC or new expansion releases. Of course, right now we do have bounties in game where you can go to, you know, different things, Crucible, Vanguard, uh, Gambit playlist and do your bounties, uh, you know, kind of for those particular playlists. But, um, Bungie is kind of wanting to change this. I've been talking about this a good a bit lately. They're going to replace uh, this with a new reward system. The devs are calling Ritual Pathfinder. These bounties are delivered by a slew of characters around the game's main hub, the tower, and feed into weekly challenges uh, that typically reward powerful gear upon completion. All of these features will now apparently be wrapped up into a single system and a pretty much present, uh, presumably a single vendor. They have not got into great detail about if there's going to be lots of vendors for this or just one. Vendors and challenges that are not directly affiliated with the outline ritual playlist will be unaffected by these changes. So things like, uh, you know, your stuff you do for Banshee 44 will not be, you know, kind of tied to this. But anything for Crucible Vanguard or the Gambit play, uh, playlist will be tied to this new uh, kind of ritual bounty idea upon the launch of the final shape all ritual bounties will be automatically abandoned which is a blow to destiny 2's bounty preppers you see in preparation of course a lot of times for new seasons new expansions most of us out there kind of uh, get a ton of bounties and pretty much keep them instead of turning them in and a lot of people do this to you know level up quickly uh once that new uh season once the new pass comes out and things like that but they said uh, bounties tend to carry over between releases meaning that cashing them in at the beginning of a new expansion or season is a way to quickly level up through the battle pass or the new level caps and get ahead of the game but Bungie uh, knowing this said that uh, they're going to you know do away with this um, during the final shapes launch with the new ritual pathfinder um, bounties that way uh, it will save the community some time and now players can get into doing things like uh you know still farming brave arsenal uh weapons and doing pantheon and things like that things we have in the game right now instead of you know pretty much hoarding up those bounties to turn in once the final shape releases so if you have some saved right now it seems that bungie is going to kind of put a stop to that i'll be curious to see if they put a stop to that going forward after the final shape but this new bounty idea does seem like it's going to be something uh, that I'm not sure if it's just a way they want to kind of bring everything together for those ritual playlist bounties and kind of put them in one place, make it a little better UI wise, a little better, uh, a little user friendly, I guess would be the best way to put that. But overall, I'm going to be interested to see how this is going to work. And of course, I know everyone out there will be grinding bounties and everything else. Considering the power level is going up, we will have a new season pass. So there will be a lot of you know, grinding going on for players once the final shape drops. Anyway, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you think about this new kind of, like I said, ritual pathfinder bounty missions is what they're calling it right now. I'm not sure that's going to stay the name. I'm sure it probably is this close to a release of the final shape. We'll have to wait and see. But it's going to be interesting to see you know what exactly they're going to change going forward considering they're already talking about you know get, getting rid of that way the players like to hoard up those bounties you know for each new season or each new dlc i'm curious to see if they will continue to change the way bounties work in destiny 2 after the final shape launches leave me a comment with your thoughts and of course if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace